side of Off the Hook Fish and Chips, which is right at Broadview and Danforth. And I've heard that it's some of the best fish and chips in Toronto, so I wanted to come try it out, and I wanted you guys to come see for yourself how good this fish and chip shop really is. Enough talking, I'm ready to eat. Let's go on in. born so he always had it on his menu and I always remember craving it once a month so it's always been something I was raised on it was kind of just liking the food and not being yeah more of a traditional thing like most people in I guess Canada or something were used to so I have to say presentation wise this is it looks incredible I think this is the biggest piece of halibut I've ever gotten this has to be at least at least 10 inches long, probably longer than that. I, my measurements are a little off, let me see. Yeah, maybe bigger than 10 inches. Probably a lot bigger, actually, than 10 inches. I didn't really know what I wanted for sides, so I opted for something that they have on their menu called Frings, which is basically if you're undecided whether or not you want fries or onion rings, you can go for Frings. Uh, first time I've ever had that is a combination, but um, it looks pretty good. I'm gonna just dig in. This really tastes like it was just off the hook. That's how fresh this is. Some fish and some fries, some nice golden fries. Mm. Mm, wow. The batter is crispy and savory, and the fish on the inside is nice, flaky, and smooth pairs perfectly well. Look how smooth and flaky this fish is. This is incredible. Look at that batter. Look how crispy that batter is. You can just see how crispy it is. You always have to have a bit of coleslaw when you're eating fish and chips. It's just per it just pairs perfectly. They're just meant to be together. It's like the perfect threesome. Well, I guess I guess foursome because I got the onion rings in there as well, but you know what? The more the merrier. Fish and chips were amazing. But if you're vegan, don't fret. They have fantastic options available to you. In fact, this is what the owner had to say. I saw at some restaurants they were doing vegetarian and they weren't going completely vegan. And a lot of my friends are vegans. So it's doing like, seeing them being mad because restaurants don't alter the food for them. I was like, no, sorry, this is the way we do it. Whatever, that's how it comes. So I'm like, why can't we make everyone eat at one place? So if fish ain't your thing, or if you're just straight up vegan or vegetarian, they have alternatives. This right here is a cauliflower taco. And I'm gonna tackle this uh, now because it's starting to break the tortilla. So I'm gonna get into this and I'll let you know what I think. Mmm, sweet and spicy. Mm. It's nice, sweet, and spicy, piping hot, incredible herbs. The sauce actually pairs perfectly with the cauliflower. What works with most meat seems to work with cauliflower too, so vegans rejoice at this knowledge. Off the Hook Fish Bar is a great place to come, kick back, and delve into a flavorful seafood experience with more options and alternatives than you could count. Try some halibut, cod, oysters, or vegan tacos. Bring a friend, a date, or your family over and have some freshly caught off-the-hook fish for you to enjoy.